<coughs> and Jeremy versus Edge, so. Yeah, that's a momentum swing. I, th I wonder if the character did that too. Yeah, especially you played Sheik for four straight games. Yeah. All right, I believe in Jeremy. This is, not, really good. this is not a fun but, uh, matchup to but Yeah, it's not. <laughs> but he's going to play Peach. So Jeremy gets revenge on Blaze from Pones. And, and from him. earlier this tournament. And from earlier, yeah. yeah. I'm glad he was able to collect himself. Heading out. All right, man. Good seeing you. Good job in Take teams, man. Sorry that was only seven fucking measly ass fucking dollars. But good job. I'm still happy for us. Didn't even pay my venue fee back. <laughs> you know, teams was one dollar. I want to show. I want to enter a fucking. I want to have chart come down with one dollar teams. <laughs> Did they change it? I have no idea. Okay. Oh, the JPEG advice. He brought up his Facebook thread and he's going to show it to him on his phone. <laughs> it's like, here, read I was this wondering if quick. he was going to go for Luigi. <laughs> JPEG, uh, Jeremy's taking games off of. Um, I think I've seen him take a game or yeah, two. Yeah, no, he's, he's taking yeah. games off, off of a pup with Luigi. So I wonder if he's going to be switching around uh -huh. this, this whole set. Um, I figure he, he feels like he has nothing to lose because he's already going to like a losing matchup, but uh -huh. we'll see. Who wouldn't mind seeing him try out Luigi? Yeah, I think this will be Maybe even good. Ganondorf on Yoshi's or we something like that. We talked about Ganondorf, it's just like, anytime you're offstage, you die. Yeah. And it's like, it's kind of like that for Luigi too, but your movement is so much better, and your aerial is so much better. Yeah. Oh. Like, Ganondorf is cool, because it's like, oh, yeah, he can kill Puff early, but it's right. like, how do you even get the damage first to get the fair? <laughs> right. Uh, Jeremy's got to be really careful about not <coughs> doing a lot of down smashes, because, like, playing all these spaces... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, and God. she doesn't do anything to yeah. Jigglypuff when she down like it does that and then eight percent or something. Yeah. yeah, nothing. It's really just like protect yourself from getting <coughs> aerial to grab. Right. I guess it's like a fake shine. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard to get it on Jigglypuff. I'm trying to think, has Jeremy taken any games as Peach against Edge? Yeah, no, there's definitely You're been like, like two out of, there's been like three two sets where okay. it's super close and it's last game, last stock. And like Edge pulls out a clutch rest or something. So. Yeah. No, they definitely, they have very close was sets. He, was he oh, Peach he yeah, at uh, Pwns? Was it Peach Puff? He was, he was Peach at Pwns, yeah. Okay. I don't know I, yeah, I saw that. Go, I saw that whole set, or I saw the end of that set. Yeah, that's crazy. Edge just barely won. Pulled it was out like the a crazy clutch box too. genetics, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I like that chase. Ooh, wow, I can't believe I killed. Yeah. I think it was just kind of like, eh, DI. Yeah. Jumping away. I don't know about grab. Game one. So much Jeremy floating, was talking about his controller too. Here. How he's been uh, f tilting a little more. Uh, so we see that it's usually like dash attacks and stuff. Oh, uh, gotcha. So yeah, he's been missing a few dashes and stuff. I think that's why he was playing worse a little earlier. Uh, he gotcha. seems to have it a bit more under control. Right. Right now, that almost killed. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's yeah, kill setup. <laughs> Yeah, so much spacing. Yeah. Edge just keeps uh, getting the edge in the uh, in the exchanges too. 
And she, I think it's just tough. It's tough for what? <laughs> I'm more concerned with you motherfuckers trying to take me away from Lee's sandwiches. Let's talk about that. Let's talk about this the first. Uh, yeah, that's fine with me. <laughs> Fuck you guys. Drop me off there. I'll Uber home and you'll never ever see me ever again. <laughs> nice nair. I, you snuck yeah, that, that in there. That's a good nair. The thing is, uh, back air is so hard to contest. Like, Peach doesn't really back have, yeah. have fast like forward mm. facing aerials and not ones that she can keep throwing out like yeah, she's got exactly. like the forward air it has such a great hitbox it's great but she gets to do it once and that's yeah. it and she can't usually, ascend to do it if again if it's like happening at the same time as the bear you're getting hit mm. and nair doesn't extend that far you have to really space it well to even hit right or you have to like get under slightly you kind of match up the edge is just really built for you just like yeah you know ready to wait it out space well And then once you think you're finally getting close, he hits you with a rust. Oh, smash clink. Oh, oh god! What coverage, yeah. It was such a long matchup. <laughs> There's nothing I can say. <laughs> oh, That's like drill a, up such smash. a good option. Yeah. Like drill grab, drill up smash. Yeah, Jigglypuff can do some nasty stuff to floaties off the yeah. drill. Mainly the wild game. <laughs> The character-to-character -character dynamics are so crazy. Very, very few games come even close to having that kind of like difference in like matchup styles. Yeah. He's going for it. He's trying it. You know, I figured he'd go for Yoshi's though, but I guess he's rocking Battlefield. Yeah. Uh, and she can crouch Ganondorf standing grab. Is, yeah. Yeah. See, when Jigglypuff crosses you up, there's like no good hitbox mm. that you can do. Right. And you gotta get that out fast. Yeah, I think if she crosses you up, I think you just have to go back to neutral and just escape. Yeah, it's like wave dash out, leave. Yeah. <laughs> Trying to go for the shields. Oh, I honestly thought it would kill. <laughs> <laughs> like that early. Gets up another air. one. Oh, I can't get the up air in time. It's good damage. The next real hit should kill. Even a back air should kill. Yeah, any aerial. Like, honestly, a tipped up air might kill with yeah. that guy. Yeah, back air. Very, Great like, right spacing, too. I wonder yeah. if, if Edge started an aerial, because it looked like it was in front of him. Right. I hate I hate Ganondorf's uh, jump vocal. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Anyone who has the aerials is just like, it gets so annoying after yeah. a while. <laughs> <laughs> That's so weird that some characters have program vocal jumps and some don't. Yeah. <laughs> and it really oh, depends on what it is. Some here. of them have it on second jump, some of uh -huh. them have it on first jump. Some have it on both. Yeah, you'd think that would be like a like universal thing. Fox jump sound effect. Ganondorf yeah. jump sound effect, just like a same file for everyone. He's a big guy, it takes a lot to jump. <laughs> Getting those boots off the ground. I think where you lose as Ganondorf in this matchup is when you try when you get one hit and just get too excited about it. Yeah. And try to make more happen. Nice, nice tech, tech, beautiful recovery. No tech in that one. Jim Puff, 69%. Perfect for a fair. Oh my goodness. Brings that choo choo train, not enough to kill. I think when it activates. Oh, oh wow. I think when Ganondorf's uh, down, uh, down B activates, if he was closer, it would have killed. Because I yeah. think it has like a lot like of kill the, power. The backwards activation. Hitbox. Yeah. yeah. That's, the, that's the meaty good hitbox. Yeah. It kills people all the time. Yeah. He's doing pretty good. Yeah, he is. Keeping him in this corner. I wonder if Edge is going to go over. Uh -huh. Yeah. But I don't know. His upper is really good. And Jigglypuff doesn't have like that great of a back hitbox. You need to get out of here. Right. Yeah. Good upper. And she has skills. like next to no falling hitbox. Oh, wow. Thanks Hold for coming, back. guys. Yeah, one more hit. Jeremy's. This is a really good stock for Jeremy. Oh, Ooh, that reaches to the so dome. far. Yeah. That's why. Did you ever fight against Ganondorf in Project M? 
Oh my god. This forward air is nasty. It's so gross. The, yeah, like, what the fuck am I fighting against? <laughs> Big black fire burning hitbox is impossible to beat. I like the jab to cover it. Oh! I thought it was a grab. See, like, when he crosses up, he can't upper out a shield. Right, the backer's right. too slow to do anything, so. Yeah. I think he should just be crossing up a lot. Very uh, Falcon esque mechanic, because Falcon functions the same way. He can't do anything behind him yeah. fast enough. Becker's just so slow. Wow, snuck that up air in there. I feel like that's like a common problem in melee a lot of the time. Yeah. A lot of people have like back and up hitboxes mm -hmm. instead of down. I'm just wondering if he's ever going to go for like a, an up beat. For a. Uh, like, Grab the punish shield. the shield, yeah. 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 Like, if he lands on a platform or something. Ooh. Oh, wow, what a tilt. Almost kick. killed. Oh, that would have uh, Yeah, now Edge is uh, really in the corner. Like, mentally, you got to be like, well, fuck. Yeah, if I get is, hit this again. This is really good, because Ganon just wants to trade. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so. Ganon definitely can be Turn around and back air to death. Just back air, back air, back air is all I do. But Jeremy knows it's better than me, and this forward air has been getting might, so like, much traction. like, wave land F-tilt or something. Oh! Ed got lucky that Jeremy... Oh, God, yeah. Oh, yeah. God. See, yeah, it's, it's, it's able to do. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> I was going to say, he's got to watch out for that. Oh, man. He played such a good game, yeah. and that's what happened. Edge, is, Edge just exists to ruin Jeremy's momentum. <laughs> wow. I think he did soft nair up tilt rest. I forgot the first part. So the up tilt like barely hit him. And then yeah. yeah. And then he tracked it. Again, he's a big fat guy. He's a big boy. Like I said, he's able to get rested. Yeah. He's large. All right, sword guy. I don't know about this. Though, sword guy used to be Edge's sword. weakness. <laughs> I want to play Sword vs. Edge. <laughs> I love Sword vs. Puff. Edge has a bow. A bow? How do you fight that? He's got a bow. Does he? Yeah, on the back of his head. No, there's no arrows, but oh, something. <laughs> That's the quiver. <laughs> well, he's doing good at getting damage. The real question is, how can you kill Ooh. him? Okay, all right. I'll do a forward like smash. Yeah. Because <laughs> Jeremy said he's not super confident in like pivots. Tip or forward smash so 30 seconds in. That's how you do it. It's going to be a little more like traditional Martin versus Puff. Right, right. Oh, that's greedy. Don't go out. This was notoriously, I'm not sure how much it still holds true, but this was notoriously Edge's kryptonite. Like, yeah. I feel like Charge was weak against Captain I mean, Falcon. I like it. And Charge e is not weak versus Captain Falcon. I think he is. Okay, maybe I'm just bad. <laughs> <laughs> So many, so many, I've seen so many Falcons beat him that I feel like, and like, like, you think Charge probably a lot better than the Mole, right? But yeah. they go to like last game That's all true. the time. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Oh, he's going for the the weird <laughs> kill setup. It's working. But yeah, this was like a matchup where like when Edge fights a Marth that's of similar skill or like slightly weaker, he still loses. He just tips crying. Doesn't know yeah. what to do. Yeah. Um, I'd like to see like sniffing out an up an up tilt. What do you need? Water? Man, this is how last game started too. It makes me makes That's me nervous F2. now. Yeah. <laughs> it's Jeremy seems to be like moving and yeah. grooving a lot more. And he's I able think to Martha's get like less combos. vulnerable too. Yeah, the problem is like like with Peach, Ganon's a spacing game. Mm -hmm. This one's definitely like combo. Like you can combo huh. Yeah, Mark That's gets the Mario screen. Slide off, yeah. See, look, that's like an easy 39. Yeah, yeah Marth fair strings against Puff are really nice. I like, like all Dare, of that was fairly so safe too. Yeah. Too. Wow. Yeah. Oh. Lots of jumps from ledges. Oh, he chased him. You can grab a shield. You should uh, neutral be him. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he wasn't shielding that time. <laughs> he knows. How do you hear me? I'm all the way over here. You have godlike hearing? 
I, I used to love neutral B against floaties and just in the air, just because I like the, the range of contest. Yeah, it's, it's, it's so like high. an aerial forward smash, basically. Yeah. Oh my god, he's got him. Jeremy's got him in the palm of his hand. Yeah, he does. This match is uh, looking really heavily Jeremy favorite. But I don't know. He's got the edge, the edge clutch sometimes. Yeah. The clutch box? I don't know. He's taking a lot of damage. Yeah. <laughs> he's just getting hit. What does he do? Grab. Ooh. Nice spot dodge. Oh, he had the right idea. Again. <laughs> Rolling around, throwing out head. See, what do you do when you have a sword? Like, you try to approach with your foot? You just yeah, put the sword on it. I I've always thought that this, at least the matchup in neutral, is super, super my favorite. But yeah. a lot of players disagree with me, so. But I just feel like it's so nice having the nice counter. The privilege of your, uh, your consistently big ass hitbox. He went for the. Oh my god. Oh, he won with like yeah. the shield on platform. I think Edge knows. Like, yeah. He can tell like people are going to go for that. Yeah. So he just plays more aerial. Nice, good recovery. Back Forward throw. throw. Nothing. Let it break out. Woo! Little Skittles. Little M&Ms. <laughs> so I think right after that, you just have to be really aggressive because they can't shield. Uh -huh. and they need to like Right, they need aerial, to jump. Yeah. They need to run away. Yeah. So, yeah. So when they have low shield? Yeah. You or ever hear homemade waffles uh, theory, or not theory, but like observation on low shield players? What? Is, uh, whenever, whenever any player has a low shield, both players start acting like an idiot. Because <laughs> the, the one with advantage is like, I need to hit him. I want to shield, shield is like, I need to do something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. need to not shield ever. <laughs> The thing is, on the board, but I no. like shielding until I can't shield anymore. Uh -huh. <laughs> Even if you have a small shield, as long as it blocks something, <laughs> then it, it works. Useful. It works. It's perfect. <laughs> don't be afraid. Just angle that shield. Power shield. You know? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. There's a stigma that comes with uh, that comes with getting your shield broken in public. <laughs> that I, I'm too afraid of that stigma. Uh, I'm, too proud. I'm happens, too proud. It happens to everyone. <laughs> I don't want to because because it's so loud in comparison to every other sound effect in the game. A shield breaks across the room. Everyone's like, Who "What happened? Who? What Who happened? happened?" Yeah. <laughs> or then you find out it's like Schuster and he hit like Ness's bat. And like, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> this one's rough though. Yeah. This is this is considerably harder to land a kill in the stage. Yeah. There's a lot more like empty space between the platforms in the uh -huh. middle that Puff has to kind of like move around. Right. And I think it's really good. Like, not only, not only are their blast zones super good for it, I think this stage is just really good in terms of its uh -huh. like length, its platform layout, and all the space. Yeah, right especially there. anti Marth. He can't he yeah. can't platform combo chase and yeah. uh, like a lot of that just, just a whole different mechanic in this uh, stage. Gonna get that up till Edge looking to take the tournament home. Make more than seven fucking dollars. Uh, <laughs> oh, nice, nice DI out, yeah. yeah. Yeah, this is frustrating as much, because like even if you're out playing them a lot, killing them is so much harder. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's floating yeah. way up there. It's really hard to get down with yeah. that too. Like, I feel like that's also just a thing uh -huh. in this game with melee characters. It's hard to get down, it's hard to hit right behind you. Marth has a decent right behind him. Like, his down air out of shield is pretty good. Yeah, down air out of shield is good. Mar just a little slow. Oh yeah. my god, he's dead. Yeah, he, he, he's piecing out. He's saying good games. He got his game. <laughs> and that is the tournament going to Jeffrey Edge Guadron. Good stuff, Edge. Um. Possibly our new uh, champion now that Kyle's a ghost. Good right? stuff to Jeremy too, though. Like I know he wants to win the tournament and stuff. He's probably sad about that. But right. he came back in losers bracket. Mm. Like he beat Mr. Wonderful, who's a soap player who was beating a bunch of people. Right. He beat. He took vengeance uh, upon Blaze. Vengeance upon Blaze right. back again. He beat Brad, who was uh, going hot. Yeah. Off, uh, of, off yeah. of a win. Both. You know? Both the Brad and Blaze sets against Jeremy were both great sets. Yeah. Yeah. Those are great sets. Um, yeah, you know, he played some very respectable melee today. For I sure. know he thinks otherwise, but he's a, he's a good player. Yeah. He's a good player. 